Hello everybody and welcome back to our Assassin's Creed Ball Hollow playthrough. This is episode number uh 521. And um last time we started a river raid along the River Severn. So we took out we didn't take out the fishing docks, we took out the Wither Farm, the small camp, we didn't deal with the eastern fortifications, we dealt with that one last time. We took out the island camp and we just took out the Smith homestead. So we found a couple more locations I could hit. I'm actually going to hit this one here just to see how difficult it is. Um, and then we're just going to explore the River Seven. We're not going to do too much backbreaking work. Because we're almost filled up on our capacity. Um... And I will eventually start upgrading the ship, uh, ship capacity and stuff, but for now, I just want to save up to try to get some other things going, like the Rain Forge. Okay, I'm pretty sure that belongs to a different river raid. Further up river, yeah, it does. Alright, so it looks like there's only a few guards. Um, defenses have increased, so we need to be mindful of that. Like, all over the river. They're on high alert. Oh, it's another small camp. Okay, so there'll probably be about 10 different defenders. At most. And those won't be hard to deal with. Dealt with them. Alright. I can't really afford these kinds of hits. To my crew. Yeah, this is a... Bigger force than was than uh, than previously, because this is a uh, an area that we've uh, we pretty much extensively massacred these force the enemies here. So this is a pretty decent sized garrison, but it's not big enough to uh, to cause too many problems. The way I'm fairly certain the uh, next place we're gonna head that big area that we pass will. Like, we're going to take casualties, but they're not going to be extreme, if that makes sense. Right. Oh, it looks like they already killed some. They killed some other raiders. You can tell from the dead bodies. And they hung one. Hung a prisoner. Yeah, okay, these guys definitely deserve to die. Lynched him. Looks like a different raiding force probably got crushed before we came in. Alright. So let's see what's in here. Probably mostly just treasure, if anything. It really isn't much. Okay. Can't hit the box because I'm on top of it. Yeah, not much. That's kind of to be expected. This is where the main stuff is. Is there any other loot? I want to make sure I'm not missing something like the key. What's that the kitty cat? Oh, a key won't be petted by me. Alright, let's force it open. Yo, know, that guy looks epic, though. Foreign supplies. So yeah, we're nearly at capacity. I think it's time to just explore for a bit. Raid completed at the small camp. So yeah, Severn's defenses are going to be up. Um, I think we're going to have to let it cool off a bit here, too. Um, I tend to try to wait on my raids. But, I mean, rating's not my strong suit. Alright. And then we make that jump. Can I get out of the bush? Thank you. <laughs> Wouldn't let me out of the bush. Alrighty. Hop right back in. Um, we're just gonna explore for a bit. So, I'm going to send us up here. Uh, 
I just realized, I missed a piece of loot. I can't abide by that. Oh, and there was an easier way down. Oh, I'm such an idiot. So we'll grab this piece of loot, and then we'll see what's up next. And the uh, reason why the alarm didn't go up is because the alarm has already been well and truly raised. I mean, this place, we hit this small camp, we hit the island camp, we hit the Smith homestead, and we hit the Wyther farm. And this small camp here. We already hit four areas before coming here. I doubt there was much more of an alarm left to raise. It's kind of sad exploring the river, uh, river raid camp, or the rivers, because it feels like there's just so much left to raid when you don't know everything that's there. But, I mean, I feel like I've got to explore one of them, right? Like, it feels like every turn you're going to have something new to raid. It just goes to show how little river raiding I have been doing. I've been doing a little bit here and there, but I haven't really been expanding too much. Okay. In here. Oh, it was behind this. That's why I couldn't find it. Okay. Give the cat some food while it waits to be, uh, or for that area to be re garrisoned. I'm sure there are Saxon reinforcements on their way. So let's get out of here and outrun them. Right, a full U-turn, and let's head down this part of the river and just see how far it goes. This really is giving me the Snottinghamshire pick ambush. I'm getting vibes from that. The narrow cliffs. Man, look at all these Roman ruins. Quite sophisticated compared to the savagery of the uh, modern day Saxon. And modern day is modern day for this. Let's just continue following the river now. We'll pass by this area without harming it. Because I don't have the forces, I think. I don't think I have the forces to take that camp. I mean, most of my unit is already... Or most of my crew is already pretty beaten up. And if we took casualties at that small camp, and that small camp had so many defenders, the next place we fight is going to be even worse. Ooh, those waterfalls are beautiful. I think I'm actually going to remove my map marker. Okay, that's gonna be another big, uh, big camp. Just gonna follow the river. Oh, hey, it's a monastery. Right there. Ooh, that looks like fun. Hitting monastery is always fun. I think I'm actually gonna do cinematic camera. I mean, I might as well. If only for a little bit. Gonna pull myself out. See what this is. Ooh. I'm actually tempted. Tempted enough to hit it. Because I'm pretty sure it's a farmstead. So I want to see how many troops are at this farmstead. Oh, it's only two. Maybe a bit more. Nope, it's the Woodmass Homestead. And there's just two defenders. Perfection, there's just one defender. It's another skirmisher. Oh, 
Alrighty. Hey, come here. So yeah, I'm just gonna continue with my raiding. Come on. Let's go, dude. Got a ration, and I think that's the end of this homestead. The Woodmus homestead has been raided. It is in the process of going up in flames. Alright, so I'm actually going to mark this area here as the next place I want to go. And then we'll make a U-turn. And just continue heading up the river. So yeah, despite my claims that this was just going to be an exploration video, I can't kick the urge to just raid a tiny bit. No racing the sail here. Sail! Catch the wind. Alrighty. Let's head to my map marker, and then we'll turn around. Another narrow passageway. Man, this river is pretty windy. Doesn't part of this empty into Gloucestershire? Okay. Start heading this way, because I've been that way. Or I actually haven't. Okay. Well, I thought I'd been that way. I pretty much just explored all around it. Run up, around and get moving all right I'm gonna now get rid of my map marker and just follow the river I love the sunset or is that the sunrise can't tell but it's beautiful either way and also a bit of a reminder that our time here is nearing an end and pretty soon we're gonna have to get going like you can't raid forever And that looks like the toughest nut to crack right here. What the heck? Yeah, this is definitely going to be the toughest nut to crack. Alright, let's get it going in reverse. Alrighty, and now let's head all the way up to the top corner. This is the final area of the River Severn, I believe. So we're going to head towards the end of it. Actually, let me take a quick look at the zoomed out map. Yeah, this is basically the end of the river. So we finally figured out what the Severn, River Severn looks like. You've got a raid spot there, a raid spot there, a couple of extra raid spots. And these are all areas that I haven't hit, too. So 
So we're gonna go down the final narrow gorge and find a couple of extra raid spots, and then we will have fully explored the River Severn apart from uh, by by boat at least. A couple more destroyed bridges, shame and a crime. All right, so you've got an easy raid spot here. If I so wanted to, I could hit the homestead. I'm gonna hit the homestead. One last, um, actually this might be a farm. One last little um, strike, and then after that strike, we're gonna head all the way up here to the final end point. Because we're almost done fully exploring the river. And then we'll return home with our booty. Because even if this has uh, foreign supplies, which I'm fairly certain it doesn't, I'm just, I'm pretty sure this Lewin homestead just has three enemy uh, archers, two of whom are dead, the other of whom is guarding, oh no, it wasn't three archers, it was two archers and a skirmisher, um, it's not exactly an utter, a big challenge. Alrighty. Let's get out of here. Almost. Let's head down here and see what's in the well. Oh, it's just a horde of rations. Okay, so if I wasn't filled up on rations, I could use that. So, I could if I so wanted. I could actually try to hit a small camp. Um, but I think that I'm going to leave that for a different episode. Actually, you know what? I have six rations. I'm not going to get the chance to do something like this again. Um, let's head over to there and then we'll fully explore in a different episode. And by fully explore, I mean just go through this final little part of the river. Hey! Or we'll just fully explore in this episode, and then once we've dispelled this part of the river, uh, like once we've gone through this part, Okay, that looks like the sail broke. Surprised the sail didn't break with all those jerky movements. Alrighty. So, that's the end of the River Severn. So, I think next time we're going to end this up. Uh, we're going to end our little adventure here with a raid. Um, we're going to raid this area here. Having finished off the uh, Lewin homestead, we're going to go raid this area. I'm pretty sure this is actually going to be like a camp or something. Um, but whatever it is, we're going to raid it. I could try to raid this area here um, as well. We'll figure it out. We're going to raid one more area while we can. We've gotten one piece of gear. Um, we haven't gotten any clues or books of knowledge, though. And there are plenty of other more difficult areas to hit. I mean, you got this area here. Um... You've got this area here, this area here especially, this big area, and then you've got a couple of small little outer defenses you can pick off. I've got a monastery. So yeah, this should be a pretty fun little adventure. Next time, of course. Let's get a bit further though. I want to see what's going on here. I want to see if I can divine whether or not this is a, uh, like a homestead or what. I think that's a camp, so I think we're going to hit this camp. Ooh, we got the Severn Blockade that we just went right past. We're going to go hit this camp next time. So, thank you guys all for watching. I hope you guys have enjoyed, and I'll see you guys all in the next one. Till then. Oh, one more thing. Um, I just want to thank everybody who stuck through with this. I mean, we're 621 episodes in. And, I mean, we're 
over 245 hours in. So thank you for everybody who's watched uh, episodes, even if you've not seen some all of them. I know some of them are pretty boring, some of them are pretty bad quality, some of them are very good quality, though. And I just want to thank you guys for watching them. I, it means a lot to me. So, till next time.